All right, Jack. First of all, welcome to Stevenage. Um, How does it feel to have got the deal signed on deadline day? Uh, it's always it's never nice leaving it this late, but I, I know the interest has been there for a few days now. And as soon as it came up, I was buzzing to hear about it and I just wanted to get it done. So, yeah, I'm, I'm happy that it's finally, finally got there in the end. I'm sure that you've um, you've watched plenty of times over the years, deadline day as it's ticking up towards the clock. What's it like to actually be involved in it? Oh, like when you're a fan, like it's it's all fun and games, and then when you're part of it, like oh, I never want to do it again. Like it was, I had a sick feeling in my belly all day, and it just felt a bit surreal. It didn't feel real. And um, tell us what what made you want to join Stevenage. So I know because um, I'm at Spurs, I've always played at Stevenage twenty uh, at the Lamex with the twenty threes. So I know the ground well. Um, it's close to home, it's local. Um, I spoke to the gaffer uh, last night and he said the intentions, the formation, what they try and do and everything just seemed really positive. I've heard really good things about the club and I just thought it'd be a great place to get some games and, and get the club up the table. You um, you come from Spurs, um, but you've got EFL experience in League Two last year, most notably with Cambridge. Um, tell us a little bit about that season and how that helped you develop as a player. Yeah, I, I, it was my first loan last year at Cambridge. I loved my time there. Um, I played a lot of football. I thought I learned a lot. And now I'm just really, really want to kick on and help Stevenage as much as I can. And a good time to join the team as well. The team are in good form off the back of a, I don't know if you saw, but a thrilling win on Saturday. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. I've been I've been following the last couple of games when, when I knew the interest was there. Uh, and I've just... Yeah, it was a madness. I saw what happened and the scenes would have definitely been number in the change room. So I'm kind of gutted I missed that one. Do you know any of the players in the changing room? Um, I was with Coach uh, towards the end of last season at Cambridge. We never got to play together because of COVID, obviously. But yeah, he came in and I think looking at the squad list, he was the only one I knew. And um, finally, you must just be super excited to get going now. I don't think you'll be eligible for tomorrow, but you know, you'll be getting yourself ready to hopefully be selected for Saturday. Yeah, um, speaking to the gaffer today, when I turned up at the training ground, he said that training tomorrow and then just build from there really and show what I can do and hopefully uh, make a good impression. I'm sure plenty of Stevenage fans will know of you because you played against us last season, for example, and made an impression in the league. But for those who don't, how would you describe yourself as a player and what do you hope to bring to the team? I'd say I'm a, a goal scorer midfielder. I like to get on the ball, create chances. But then saying that, there's also the other side of the game where you've got to run for the team, you've got to put your foot in. And I'd say I'd, I'd love to do that side of the game as well. So I think if we can, if we're on top of teams, I think I'll be at my best getting on the ball. But then at the same time, when, when we need that bit of grit and hard work, I'm more than happy to do that for the team. All right, perfect. Well, welcome once again and um, thanks for your time. Thank you very much.